Okay, now we have the last example for lecture 3. So, given that y equals to 2 e power of negative 2x plus 3 e power of 3x, then show that d2y over dx squared minus dy over dx equals to 6y minus 6y equals to 0. Okay, the first thing here, when you look at this things that we need to show there has a second derivative and first derivative so here we got y so find dy over dx so multiply 2 with negative 2 so becomes negative 4 e power of negative 2x plus 3 times 3 9 e power of 3x this is the First, uh, first derivative and then we need to find the second derivative so d2y over dx squared so we need to differentiate dy over dx again okay so negative 4 times negative 2 so it becomes positive 8 and then e power of negative 2x and then plus 9 times 3 27 e power of 3x Okay, so this is the d2y over dx squared. Now we need to show d2y over dx squared minus dy over dx minus 6y equals to 0. Okay, so this is left hand side and then this is right hand side. The right hand side equals to 0. So the right hand side equals to 0. We cannot do anything. So we just take at, at the left hand side only. So, the left hand side, when we write down here, uh, d2y, d2y over dx squared minus dy over dx minus 6y, we need to make it as equals to 0. So, here left hand side, uh, d2y over dx squared is a e negative 2x plus 27 e power of 3x minus with in the bracket put dy over dx negative 4 e power of negative 2x plus 9 e power of 3x close the bracket minus 6y y is 2 e power of negative 2x plus 3 e power of 3x okay and then we need to uh, simplify okay so we got here a e power of 2x plus here minus minus becomes plus 4 e power of negative 2x and then here 6 times 2 becomes negative 12 so we have a plus 4 plus minus 12 so we will have a e power of negative 2x plus 4 e power of negative 2x minus 12 e power of negative 2x and then plus 27 e power of 3x here minus and plus so because we got negative 9 e power of 3x here negative 6 multiply with 3 so it becomes negative 18 e power of 3x okay now 8 plus 4 is 12 minus 12 it becomes 0 and then 27 minus 9 is um, 18 and then minus with 18 and it becomes 0 so when it is become zero so it is equals as as the right hand side so therefore it is shown okay here we have some exercise so this is as your homework thank you